Hey, and welcome to another episode of the Couchfield Light Bites. That was a crazy week. That was a crazy week, man. Last week we did this and we did that other thing. Um, I didn't do anything. <laughs> I'm out. Alright. I've ad libbed and now I'm done. I have lived. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's go to Fujira City because I can. Shit, yeah. I can't say anything. What you got? Bikes! That's what we got. I got bikes! They're multiplying. Do do do! Yep. Do do. That's a fucked up movie, apparently. Grease. Yeah. Like, there was a guy who. No grease in at all. Yeah. Well, well it's open to here. It doesn't take place in grease, yeah. It's not spelt the same way. It's spelt the way of the um, stuff that goes in the hair or food. But no, it was a. Uh, it's a weird mo movie, isn't it? But uh, how? Yeah. Get the store room off it. Yeah. That's <laughs> fine, I guess. No, it's not fine. Good old John for both. Have you ever watched? I had this conversation with Brian. Uh huh. Broken Arrow. I have not actually watched it. But I know that's the one about the nuclear weapons on the train. Uh, yes. It starts out the plane, of course. Oh, because, you know. Yeah, I, I've actually not watched that one, maybe, no. Oh, you only eat half of it. Yeah, you. The larger food items, you only eat bits of. See? Oh. See the people on the bikes? Yeah, they kind of remind me of, um. Akira? No, uh, Major Bossman from Ghost Oh, okay. Also. Are they half naked? Yeah. I watched the Kira movie. That's a good movie. First time I've watched it since we watched it. Yeah. That's a long time ago, we did that. Yeah. Have I watched it since? I just like the board of like, doo doo! Was that doo -doo. the one where he makes the woman out of the robot? Mm. And they want to get up to the city in the sky? No. no. Okay. Akira is the one where basically some guy is actually going to find out you've got latent psychic abilities and then quickly blow up the Neo Tokyo. Most psychic child. Okay. Yeah. All the hero. Yeah. He's sort of a collective consciousness. Uh, that he gets in contact with and becomes infected by? Yes. Oh, we're on a boat now. Akira's great. I like the soundtrack. It's the movie is pretty young. It is all over the place in a, in a really great way because um, you can very much make what you want for the movie. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah, it's kind of cool. It's like. Hugely revolutionary. Um, is it, what was it, 1988? Something like that. And it's just, it's just stunning to look at. Like it, hold, yeah. it holds up really well <laughs> for something that was, uh, you know, uh, created 30 years ago. This guy hated. Yeah. Some good uh, brand stuff. I saw. Is that your thing? Get the yellow one though. Tiger Iris? No, oh, you are not a boat. I am yellow eye. Yellow oh. colors. I can see silver. Ah, oh, this guy's teleporting. Sinking shadows. Oh, these games. <laughs> this is like the one of the later ones that they did. Yeah. Screw you! Screw you! Ha ha ha, I will deal with you now, incompetent bounty hunters. Oh, 
be cheating man in the thing. It's a... A pig. A cow? Is, what is this guy? He's a, a samurai motorcycle. Yeah, man. With multiple heads. He's a cyber samurai. Cyber samurai. Isn't that a cartoon? Oh, oh yeah. Um, Akira holds up very well. Yeah, we don't read into it. Oh, it's, that's the good part. Is it's like, like I say, is that it's literally kind of about nothing. Yeah. It's a really very basic oh, gee, um, plot line. I just uh, hit the head off that uh, cow. But the plot line is essentially exactly as we said, and then it just kind of goes along from there. Yeah, yeah. So. Of course the shell's good too. I haven't watched it in a while though. Of course the shell is alright, yeah. I kind of like the soundtrack and that too. That's like when they first started to go over to uh, 3D. That's cool. I was actually watching a, a YouTube channel for animation. I can't remember what it was. But he goes into how uh, Guilt Gear excerpts. Yep. You know the new ones. And you go like, oh, it's 3D. That's good. Yeah. And it's, it's in 3D, right? But they go into it and says, yeah, so everyone would think it would be easier to animate this in 3D and all that shit. But they went and like animated their whole sprites set up themselves. They didn't like use any additional like um like the like moving the arm and that they actually drew a little like 3D model type thing. <laughs> for them to uh, So it's just rendering it's just basically uh, a 3D what model you're calling, um, just the thing where you trace over images. Scoping. Yeah. So like the, the Prince of Persian 3D models. No, 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 no. They're they're they actually are 3D models. They just they uh, used the, the, the like a sprite animation for them rather than using computer to go like this is what would happen. This is how it should be. <laughs> they they actually seem to like put their own keyframes in. That's mental. That is mental, that's mental with what, they, what they've done. It's like, what? Have you seen Guilty of Gears or Oz? No. It's a ridiculously stunning, uh, what looks like 2D, um, beat up. Yeah. And yeah. then, uh, when the special moves hit, the camera starts panning in and around the characters and they're actually in 3D. Yeah, and, oh, you, nice. go, and you go, shit, that's 3D. It, it, it is legitimately like they've, uh, <laughs> they've made a 3D character. Uh, yeah. it's so fucking cool. Which is why they also got the, the Dragon Ball Z. Yes, they did uh, Fighters, didn't they? Yeah. Which looked awesome as well. So. Yeah, and that's that's 3D really too. I do need to pick up at some point. It's going cheap at the moment, I think. Is it? Yeah. I, I finally spent my Xbox vouchers at the <laughs> Halloween sale and still haven't played any of the games I got. <laughs> I got both the Layers of Fears games, The Observer, uh, both the Outlast games. Um, you never completed that last. I was too scared. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus, man. What the fuck? Why am I in it? Oh, like, it's a scary game. I'm not going to complete this. It's too fucking scary. There's a cheap point for you. You on the. do the Xbox reward things? Uh, yeah. Because I don't know how much. I'm alright, it used to just give you like discount on games. Yeah, although to be fair, like, <laughs> at the rate things are going, like, it's not like I'm paying much for games these days anyway. Like, with it, that, that whole uh, Game Pass thing, 